Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Dark Metal video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the latest stage, stage 9 of the Memorable Battles movie edition and basically just how you can beat it. Now this is against Super Janemba. Uh, it's actually a pretty rough stage. Uh, Super Janemba is pretty buff, uh, I'm not going to lie and basically he can kind of just come at you hit you with an incredibly hard uh, super attack and then just kind of leave you in a very very rough position so honestly yeah he's really quite tough uh, what i will say you know for the most part is that evasion i find tends to be the best solution here now how Janemba works as a boss is he's actually quite tough, he has quite high defense, he has like 2 million defense alongside quite a sizable chunk of damage reduction. Uh, for every attack you do, you will lower, or every unarmed attack you do, uh, you will lower that damage reduction, or that defense, sorry, which does make it a little bit easier. However, for every attack you do, you also will raise his attack by 10%. So the more you attack him, the harder he's going to hit. Now, there is a way around this. Uh, kind of. So, obviously, no matter how hard he hits, just avoid it. And then you tend to have a pretty good time. Now, what I will say uh, for me is also there's an additional one turn buff depending on if he's been hit by a strength character and because we have to have one character each type it is somewhat uh, unavoidable hitting him with a strength character but trying to minimize your strength characters which sounds a bit weird against physical boss to prevent this from happening every single turn at least that's what I did and I found it made it way more manageable now in terms of uh, like the missions obviously the missions want us to prioritize having one unit of each type they also want us to prioritize uh, using no support items but they don't designate using no support memories so there is that small loophole that we can use to kind of generate a little bit of a better you know understanding a little bit of a better kind of control around you know like around the boss you know, give us a little bit of a boost whether it's a heal an attack and defense buff whatever now i went superheroes because of two reasons firstly you have access to the uh mui goku and the vegeta vegeta is one of the few int units outside of like int burly that can uh, actually deal with Janemba's very, very hard hitting attacks. So that is something that is very helpful and very, very useful. Aside from that as well, uh, obviously it gives us double revives, which is very helpful when you have someone that can launch like a 5 million super attack at you. And then what it also does is enables me to take a friend Beast Gohan. Now, why Beast Gohan is so useful here Firstly, obviously type advantage, although he has guards, so it doesn't really matter. Um, but the big thing is he has a very, very early interrupt or intercept. And the thing is with the very, very early intercept is it helps us out because it prevents us from taking excessive damage from Janemba. And this then causes us to kind of sit in a position where we can have all the other units do a lot of really, really good damage. Uh, overall so for me uh, I found that the early intercept was incredibly useful uh, compared to some of the later ones and it's probably what made uh, running it with Beast Gohan so much easier outside of that everyone else did plenty of great damage so we had a pretty good time overall uh, all in all it was tough uh, I won't lie it was not a easy one uh, it took a couple of tries. I think it took me around about, um, I'd like to say probably six tries or so. Did need a bit of RNG to kind of pull through. Uh, and of course we got the revive here. 
So, you know, really maximizing everything. But once you kind of got the rotations you wanted, once you got these Gohan in one rotation, uh, and once you got the MUI and the Vegeta combo in the other, then generally it tended to be fine. Obviously you can replace units here uh, with plenty of great units. There's tons of really, really good options that players are welcome to use. So you don't have to, you know, necessarily use like this exact team although you know obviously there are benefits um to using this exact team and that you've seen it run the stage uh, we did have the easy a for the uh, tech goku and vegeta angel which is obviously great and really really helpful so that does help out uh, overall but yeah i would say for me um this team ran very nicely uh, and I was very very happy with like in general um, just how this team did like I think overall it was a very good run very nicely done and we got it done so I mean that's that's all that matters but that's it for me I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please leave a like it's always appreciated and I will see you guys in the next one so until then as always, take care, stay safe, and let me know if you need any help with any of the challenges. Otherwise, until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. And bye.